With the onset of AI, we now have some really cool tools that we can use on a daily basis to make our lives so much easier. Today, we're going to be talking about Descript, the AI video editor with a difference. Now, before we go ahead and do that, I just want to let you know, here at Product Creation Formula, we love to give you tips and tricks to better help you create your products quickly and easily. Along with that, we also do product reviews, as well as tips on how to make money online. So if that's the sort of thing that interests you, how about you smash the like button as well as subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can be notified whenever we upload more videos. All right, guys, let's go check it out. Now, there's at least five things in Descript that makes this unique from pretty much any other video editor out there. Now, we're going to be exploring some of those features today and we're going to have a look at what you can do and why it's so unique. All right, so what we're going to be doing, I'll just give you a little bit of a brief rundown. What you got here, obviously this is the main page, but we can have a quick look at the pricing if we wish to. And the pricing for Descript is pretty good. So we'll have a quick look here. So when you first sign up, you can sign up for free and you get three hours of transcript. You also get full audio and video editing capabilities. You get unlimited screen recordings, overdub trial, and studio sound effects. Now, if you decide to go for your $12 one, which is everything in the free, plus 10 hours of transcripts per month, and also watermark free video export. With the other ones you get watermarks, but this one you don't get watermarks with it, which is why it's worth paying for it. Then over here, you got your pro, you get 30 hours of video transcript, unlimited overdub, filler word pro, audiograms, publish pro, batch file export, and custom drive and page branding. Okay, this is the one I'm currently in, and it's the one that I use all the time, so it's the one I would prefer to teach you about. When you first go into Descript, what happens is it allows you to be able to download some software. And this is what you download. This is what you download onto your desktop, and this is where you work mostly. But you also have an option of signing in online, but it doesn't have a lot of the same features that you would get if you were just doing it from the one you download onto your desktop. So we're going to be mainly working on the desktop one today, so as you can see what it's like. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go over here, click on this, and we're going to be going here to New Project. I'm going to click on that. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to download a project. Now, what's going to be the name of the project? Well, let me find that for you, and I'll tell you. It's called Three Traffic Sources to Drive Targeted Traffic to Your Site or Offer. Okay, so we're going to just go here. We're going to put this straight into there. So let's just click on here. Well, actually, I'm going to rename that. I'm just going to hit right click here, and then we're going to hit rename. And I'm just going to copy all that text and put that straight into here. Save me having to worry about typing it up. Okay, and then we're going to create a workspace. And in just a moment, it's going to open up where we can now download the video. Now, if we want to, we can also put in text if we wish to, and then we can also have it create a voiceover for us. You also have a thing called overdub. Now overdub will look at your voice that you're putting in there and it'll train the AI to be able to put your voice in if you wish to. We've got here, I've got, I'm just going to click on there. Now I've got a few of them here. And if you've ever watched any of my Descript videos in the past, you'll see I usually use this one here, Henry Excited. And this one that sounds much better. But right now, all we're going to be doing is going to choose a file and then we're going to be dropping that straight into this section here. But to make it easier for myself, I already have the file ready here. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab it and drop it straight in there. So I'm just going to grab this file right here, left click and just drag it straight across to here and drop it straight in there. And in just a moment, what it'll do, it'll transcribe my video. It'll put the video in there and then it'll transcribe it. And that's where we're going to be doing a lot of our editing through the actual transcription. I'm going to pause the video while we wait for this to do its thing and we'll come straight back. Now, for the sake of the video, I know that this first part is where the introduction is, is perfectly fine. There's no mistakes in this section. So let's go over here to the very first part where it begins. Now, what we need to do is hit play and we'll listen to what it says and we'll be able to pretty quickly pick up on any mistakes that are made. Traffic source number one is Facebook. Now, Facebook is a really powerful place to be able to send targeted traffic to your site. Firstly, I mean, obviously you've got the paid. OK, so what I can do there is I can get rid of all of this and get rid of firstly, and then I'll just get rid of, I mean, obviously, and I'll just delete that and watch what happens when I delete that. 
I'm going to just go back one space just to bring it a little bit closer. Now watch what happens. We can just hit from there. That'll do. And we'll press play and we'll see what it does. Powerful place to be able to send targeted traffic to your site. Firstly, you've got the paid side of things where you can pay to do that. How because I'm recording, I think this is not working quite as clearly as it normally would. Believe me, it does come through very nicely once it's finished. However, I find that that's an extremely expensive way of doing it. So what I do if I want to drive people to my site or any of my offers or videos, what I do is I actually... Well, I can get there, get rid of the word actually, because I don't like using the word actually. I say it a lot. When, it sound, when you're listening to your video back, it doesn't sound great. So what I'm also do is have a look here. What I do is I drive traffic to my site or any of my offers. Okay, so we'll get rid of all videos. We can say what I do and we'll get rid of that by just backspacing. And we'll have listen to it again and see how much more professional that sounds. What I do if I want to drive people to my site or any of my offers, what I do is I put the link directly into. Okay, we can get what I do is get rid of that twice because I've said it twice now. And I can just put where it says I, get rid of that. It just makes your video look so much more professional. Now remembering I am recording, so that's why this is not following along as clearly or as easily. But when you download it, it will come through perfectly normal. Site or any of my offers, I put the link directly into Facebook. See, that sounded absolutely fantastic with that. And I have to say, I love the fact that you can do that. Now, if you want to say, for example, shrink this down, what you can do is you grab this tool right here called the blade tool. Normally you start off with this tool, but what you can do is you can grab this tool here and you can take the cursor to right there slice that just there and then take it across to here slice that right there now you go to the left of that marker and then you drag that across until it meets this section just here which then takes away some of the blank space and you can do that quite a bit now if you want to put a word in there for example let's say i want to put the word for now example I, an affiliate link in i'll pause that for one second say i want to put the word for example I can Facebook. go there. What I can do is I can highlight over one particular word or in this particular case, it's a full stop. I'm going to hit correct. Then I'm going to go, for example, I put the space there. For example, I'm going to put a full stop. We're going to go correct. Now I haven't said, for example, in this particular place, but if I wanted to say, for example, I would highlight over the top of that and then I would hit overdub. Now this is where I'm going to be having to use my own specific voice. So I'm going to go here go detect speaker and what's going to happen is it's going to detect the speaker for me and then i'm going to find the right one i want and we can put that over the top of this word i'm going to be choosing the voice now the voice we're going to be choosing is henry excited to choosing that one excited to and that's the voice we're going to be choosing to go into this spot right here just that spot right there overdub and that's the section that's going to now overdub our voice. Now, in just a moment, it's going to say Facebook, for example. And in just a moment, it's going to now fix it all up. And it'll come back up on the screen in just a moment. As you can see, it's still thinking and still coming up with that's where it's going to be putting all the words. So we'll pause the video until that's finished. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to play it from this point here. I had to put it on another line to make it work properly. So I'm just going to go hit play and we'll have a listen. I put the link directly into Facebook, for example. Now, I don't ever put... Now, that didn't sound great, but it's better than nothing. If you, say, for example, only have one word or two words to put in there, you can use that. Anyhow, that is how you do that. That's part of why this one is a little bit different. The main difference between this particular AI video editor and any other AI video editor is that it gives you a transcript of the video which you can then place that straight into your blog posts if you wish to or anywhere else you might even want to turn that into part of an ebook so that is the next thing that makes it different so we have the fact that the video editor uses words that we can then remove from the video if we want to make it more unique to make it sound more professional as well it also uses a transcript which is really awesome so you can put that into your video editor. It also does overdub, which is fantastic. It allows you to be able to remove stutters. Say for example, you've got somewhere here in the video where it's, I might've said the same word twice 
or anything like that, you can literally just remove one of those stutters, one of those words, and it makes it really easy and it makes your video sound far more professional. And it also gives you the option, if you wish to, to literally put a whole new voice in there. Like, let me show you something for one second. Let's just click on this section just here. Now, as you can see, we've got all my voices just here. But if you look at their stock voices, also have one called Don. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's I love important. Don. His voice is so good. Then you have Emily, Carla, Ruth, Malcolm. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. He sounds amazing as well. Then you got Ethan. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. Then you also have Henry. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the good times. And Nancy and Nicholas. Let's listen to Nicholas. Life is like a camera. Just focus on what's important. Capture the... As you can see, these voiceovers are fantastic. Better than most other voiceovers you'll find. And you can use that as well. So you can use the voiceover for this. And if you want to, you can then turn that into a picture video if you wish to. Now, just to let you know that all of this is going to be down in the description down below. Guys, now if you got some value out of this video, how about you smash the like button as well as subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can be notified whenever we upload more videos. Hey, while you're at it, why not consider sharing and also leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of the video. Now, over here is a video I believe you might like. Down here is a video YouTube thinks you might like. And right here is an image of my head. If you click on that, you'll be able to subscribe. All right, guys, thank you so, so much for watching. And bye for now.